I'm, I'm, I'm joking. Uh, just the, the mindset of the team going into this weekend. Um, just come out and play hard. I mean, that's what we do every day. Um, we've lost four straight, but I mean, there hasn't really been a common theme to each loss. It's been for different reasons each time. Um, we've uh, actually, there's a lot of good out of all four losses. You can pick and point um, a lot of good parts. So, um, you know, we're, we're very confident. We know, we know who we are. We know what we can do. We know what we're capable of. Uh, Coach Thompson was actually showing me uh, the record of some of the teams he's been on and some of the Omaha teams from past uh, here at Arkansas and they float around 500 early and then they go on a run so we're not worried about it. You've been behind Bolden for 10 innings now what have you seen out of uh, what he's thrown this year? Fills it up he's not scared to uh, use his best pitch and attack and uh, he gets a lot of weak contact it's fun to uh, it's fun to play behind him because he keeps the rhythm going. So he's got the Saturday assignment what do you feel like uh, well, first of all, with Nolan not pitching Friday, it kind of moves the pitching rotation around. What do you think about it? Um, well, obviously, that moves Wick up. And in our opinion, Wick and Nolan are two very, very good guys that could go Friday for almost every team. And we're uh, a very confident team behind them. And we have a lot of um, a lot of faith in them. You always talk about how Casey Martin's kind of been a mentor you know, really in the infield. What was it like to see him kind of get it going this last game? Well, Casey has been an unbelievable teammate through all of it. Uh, you know, his attitude never changes whether he's good or bad, uh, has a good or a bad game. And, um, you know, it's great to see uh, him, you know, come out of a shell a little bit. And we feel like he's going to continue to get better. And no one was worried about him. Um, I remember the day he uh, had the day off, uh, I came up to him and said, hey, man, no one's worried about you. Um, we have a lot of faith in you. When you're on, you're our, our most talented guy. So um, just. He's uh, continued to lift us up and teach us a lot. And um, yeah, excited for him. Just South Alabama this weekend, another chance to get back out there and kind of end the streak. Pardon me? Just facing South Alabama and getting back out there this weekend. Oh, yeah. You know, they have a, they have a Friday night guy that's going to be really good. And, um, you know, they've had success in the past. So it'll be a good challenge for us. Can you said something along the lines of when you came in here? He was expecting to play good defense, and then, you know, whatever they got from you offensively was, you know, just kind of icing on the top of the cake. What have you done, though, maybe at the plate that's exceeded any expectations, you think? Um, well, I always believed I was going to hit. I wouldn't have showed up here if I didn't think I was going to. And, um, you know, just slowing things down and being selective and taking your walk and uh, zoning a pitch and uh, getting your best swing off.